speakers at a wedding is not usual and to carry on that tradition and upstage my now father-in-law I've decided to sing a dedicated song yeah. Christmas, birthday, or wedding thank you cards. My contribution will be the uh, and James at the bottom. So, <laughs> thank you from Josie and James. <laughs> the thanks I should really give is to you, Josie. You have planned this entire wedding. <laughs> and a special thanks for actually marrying me. Thank you. <laughs> I truly know how I feel I am. I think a question some people may ask is about how did we meet? And yep, Inch.com. <laughs> I thought perhaps I can offer my perspective of how we met. So, Joseph and I did start speaking through an app, Inch.com. <laughs> one of the better apps, I might add. One of the matches, obviously. Um, <laughs> we hit off pretty well. We uh, started talking about how uh, a monk was whipping her, or something like that. And we spoke for a while after that. Quite a while. Um, it felt like an absolute eternity before I was granted a booking for a date <laughs> with Josie and her incredibly busy calendar, which I know many of you know the pain of, and even now I still need to book ahead. <laughs> the night before our first date, I went to a work sleep event, uh, one with free drinks, and being 25 at the time, I had about as much as well, as much self-control as you can probably imagine. <laughs> Fast forward through drinking my way through Paul Church and ending up in uh, an Indian restaurant in the early hours. I forget some parts, but uh, I woke up in a garden in the station and <laughs> unable to face. He was there with me. <laughs> unable to face getting a train home, I opted in for a very queasy cab ride home. And by the time I got in and saw my curry from the night before reappear. Uh, I didn't have much time before first date, so I tried my luck and asked Josie, hey, can we push back a couple of hours? No, one pm's fine, thanks. Once <laughs> 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 time I turned up, I was a little late, I was a lot rough, and I was already accepting that I might have ruined my chances here. The feeling that only got worse um, once I laid eyes upon this absolute stunner in front of me wearing a summery jumpsuit. We ended up chatting for a few hours and turns out I didn't need my A game or, or any game. We just got on. And then as we stood up to say goodbye, I must admit my gaze missed Josie's by a few inches too high for as I adjusted. <laughs> oh, <shit. laughs> And Josie had poor enough judgment to take me off on a second date. A second date, I might add, that I, uh, <laughs> I uh, shakily blagged my way through a climbing supervisor test and literally had her life in my hands. But it went well. She lives, and I got a kiss out of it. <laughs> sign of commitment, which some here might attest to. I even asked friends to swear me off of getting into a relationship for the very reason that I knew that I wasn't ready. 
as the cliche goes, you turned up when I was least expecting you. And every step of the way, it's felt natural. <laughs> My now father-in-law gave me some advice a while ago. If it feels right, it is right. <laughs> and <laughs> you might have a go. And on a separate occasion, my now mother-in-law gave me the advice, if it doesn't feel right, it isn't right. Truly! <laughs> I couldn't agree more. And wanted to spend the rest of my life with you, Jason, you couldn't feel more right. Of course, Glenn was talking about wallpapering at the time, and Jill was talking about a strange danger when we were in London at night. <laughs> but I found it very hard to <laughs> Josie, I could stand here all day telling you how beautiful you look, and all the cliches a groom should say to their bride on their wedding day, and they would all be true. The, the simple fact is, you being in my life makes it a better one. As your husband, I would never take that for granted. And today, in front of our families, I vowed that I'd be to you all that you are to me. And on that note, I'd like to raise a toast. To the one that makes me whole, to the one that I love, to Joseph. To Joseph! <laughs> Alright, down to business. <laughs> Read it as it's written, as I was told. <laughs> we are so happy to celebrate with you all, as instructed by my wife. I'm already used to anyway. Please make sure that you record your messages on the phone guestbook downstairs. And please make sure you capture all your memories on the Pro Work camera and sign it over by the entrance over there. Surely, I'm sure you'll start to notice that uh, some food will be being prepared. So please enjoy an assortment of small plays, eat as many as you want, as much as you want. Let's have a great night! <laughs>